Good morning, today is Monday, it's 8 o'clock in the morning. I've just got out of bed, uh, literally threw on some clothes, got out of bed, and uh, you can hear Riley squeaking in his cage. So yeah, uh, you're coming with me today as I go about my day and you'll see what's what goes down in my house. This is Mr. Wiley. This is how Riley wakes up every morning. He's manic. Sit. Sit. So, oh, sit. Stay. Come on then, good boy. And now he's running around chasing off the Yoshi Ashitsu. Both want to go in the garden. Say good morning, Mr. Yoshi. Say morning. Morning, Riley. I'm back inside now, just to let the uh, let the doggies out for their morning whittles, whistles, little wheeze, bop bops, and uh, it's a little bit wet out there today. Uh, not too cold, it's April, so not too bad. Um, but yeah, so I have to, whenever I take Riley out in the morning, uh, he has to go on his lead because he's a naughty boy. He likes to, he likes to eat stuff he shouldn't. What's going on with this focus? Yeah, Riley likes to eat stuff he shouldn't eat and he gets quite sick. And uh, we have incidents if he's not being watched properly when he's outside so I have to take him out on his lead now which is kind of annoying having to go out with him every time but you know you, you gotta you gotta do it Yoshi's out there at the moment Yoshi seems to take forever in the mornings uh, doing his business so he so he likes to stay outside anyway and he you know he's uh he's two two and a bit now so you can kind of trust Yoshi to be outside on his own. Uh, he's over there at the moment. Yeah, so um, what's on the agenda today? Well, got to feed the dogs first. Then I've got to feed myself, have my morning coffee. Uh, yeah, and then I'll get back to you. Yoshi, you're coming in, babe. Yoshmash. He, he won't come in. So what's for my breakfast? Let's see. Probably, probably egg on, egg on toast for my breakfast. Seems to be what I have most mornings. Uh, what's in my cupboard? Let's have a look. So, this is interesting. I didn't expect to be doing this. Coffee, that's why I wanted to go in here. <clears throat> At the moment, we're, ha we're having Aldi, uh, out some Aldi coffee filter coffee. Um, I have been started off drinking coffee not too long ago actually. Started on granular coffee but um, but I've moved on to filter coffee since. Uh, actually that's a lie. I started off on Tassimo coffee and I wouldn't have anything else. But then I moved on to granular coffee because it's cheaper. Uh, and then I tried filter coffee and kind of got addicted to this now. The, the quality is just so much better. So anyway, this is from Audi. This is like f cheap. It's like I think it's one, nearly less than two pound, something like that, for a bag like this, and it just tastes so good. So they come in different types. This is the cheetah one. Uh, this is strength five, and it's got a deep, rich, syrupy flavour with subtle notes of chocolate. And it has. It, I know you might think. It's, it's just saying that, but it has, you can taste it. And um, at the moment we're drinking the Zebra one, which is the four strength coffee. Uh, that's really nice, that's got a little bit of zest to it. That nice, Wiley. You good boy.
And this is my breakfast. I've got three miniature eggs. Uh, come from a mixed range pack, so these were the small ones that were left. Uh, yeah, so I did those on toast. Got my coffee, got my glass of water, and I'm good to go. Alright, so I'm in the studio now, where I usually do my work, working from home. Um, I paint miniature figurines for a living. But I've still got a bit of time before I start work, so what I like to do, if I've got that time, is I like to work on a project, or play a video game or something, just sort of spend a bit of time doing something I want to before I start work. Because I don't always find time in the evening to do that. Especially when Karina gets back uh, from work. So, so what I'm going to do is I've been working on a video series um, based on a, my favourite video game series, which is The Legend of Zelda. And what I'm doing is called Details in the Dungeon. And uh, basically, I am analysing dungeon design in Zelda games. And I've started off with Twilight Princess HD, which came out not too long ago. And I've already done the first dungeon, which was a forest dungeon. And now I'm working on the second dungeon, which is the Goron Mines. And I think it's that so far it's going better than the first dungeon. The first one came out okay, this one's going to come out a bit better. Hopefully I'm just going to get better over time. So I thought I'd give you a little sneak preview of what some of the commentary recording is like. The only way to move forward is to go through it. And so we are forced to use our bow. Shit. <coughs> immediately after, immediately after, we run to one of these doors that we saw earlier. Alright, so that was me just recording one little bit of commentary. Um, so basically what happens is I watch a bit of footage, uh, I sort of think about what I'm going to say in my head, open up Audacity, start recording, and then just see how it comes out. Um, a lot of the time I have to, have to sort of say the first bit and then there's a little gap before I think about what I want to say next. Um, so then I have to go into Audacity and chop up those gaps, get rid of them, so it sort of sounds half normal. I could script it all, I could write write it all out, um, but I just, I don't know, I don't have the time to do that. And I like to do it on the fly, it just seems more natural to just word it as if I was talking to someone rather than writing a review or something like that. So, so yeah, so now I've got to do some chopping. Chop, 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 chop. Alright, so I've just finished chopping the first bit, and this is what it sounds like. Immediately after, we run to one of these doors that we saw earlier. We know we have to swipe at the rope to open the door, but we can't physically reach it. So it's obvious that you have to use the hero's bow to shoot at the rope from a distance. Having this the only way to move forward is a brilliant way to teach the player a potential use for using the bow. So that's one line. That's one line. In the bag. On to the next one. Doggies, Mr. Yosh, we're going to take you out for a walk. We go for a walk. What are you doing? What are you doing? You just ping that thing. We're going to take doggies for a walk. That's what we're doing now. We're back after our dog walk, and we spent all afternoon looking at cars. We're uh, thinking about upgrading our car, so looking at cars on uh, car videos on YouTube trying to see what would best suit our needs good price range etc uh, then we had uh, some garlic chicken Kievs uh, with some salad for dinner which was lovely and now we're watching Terminator Genesis on now TV so that's pretty good so that's our evening um, so I think we're gonna call it a vlog and we'll catch you later bye